Hey Mark, this is Matt with Search Strategy. I hope you had a great time on your cruise. Uh, in this video, I just want to show you how you can outrank these guys here, Southern Services, Landscape and Irrigation, for the keyword Denton Landscaping. Uh, there's some volume that comes with that. There's 110 searches a month for that. And I want to show you how you can get in these positions here uh, to come up for that particular search. And uh, yeah, I'd just love it if you give me some feedback. And if you have any questions, let me know. And let me just jump into it. So first and foremost, I love the work. It's gorgeous stuff. Uh, I'd love to see more of it. Um, yeah, the Google likes to see uh, on your homepage anywhere from um, 1500 words and, or, or more to when it comes to the level of competition that you have, and that's not a fierce competition, but what it does allow you to do when you have more content is to put more keywords in. So folks who put in a, a term like Denton Landscaping, they're looking for somebody to help them. So the more that you put in your uh, those keywords, the more that you're gonna show up for uh, that kind of search, potentially to get some of the traffic that's available for it. So you, you could just expand on the landscape creations, the stonework, the riverbeds, uh, and talk about those services and where you're doing them. Uh, and those are the kinds of keywords that you'd want to come up for. Uh, so that, that would be something that I would recommend uh, that you do. These guys here, they don't have a ton of content. They've got a little bit. I've got this video, which is nice. But, um, you know, I think you could certainly outrank them just by doing more content and talking about Denton area. And you can tell here that they've got in their uh, title tag, they, they mention Denton, Texas, uh, whereas you're just talking about landscapes. We're not exactly sure where that is. You want to be really explicit with Google um, where you are. Uh, the other thing is I love the call to, uh, the click to call. Well, actually, I don't know if it's clicking here. Uh, if it's on a mobile phone, it should be able to click. If it's not, you want to correct that. And also uh, a nice call to action button would be good here. Just a button that says, uh, you know, get, a, get an estimate or something or, or get your free consultation. Just make it easy to get from here to there. All right. So that would be the first part. Uh, it's talking about content on the page. The next thing I want to talk about are backlinks. And so a backlink is, is essentially a, a link from any other website to your website uh, from text uh, or an image. And it, it just says uh, you know, to Google, these we're endorsing this, uh, we're endorsing Argyle Landscapes. Um, we, and the more that you are getting these endorsements, you, more, the more that others are vouching for you, the more likely it is that you are uh, gonna be shown in search for some of the terms that you're trying to rank for. So the more backlinks you have, uh, the better. So you have 16 websites with 37 total links coming to you. you get, and that's resulting in just relatively low traffic, which is 16 searches per month. Uh, and some of that is just actually, it's all coming from people knowing you by name. They're just typing in your name into the Google search bar and you're coming up. So you want to come up for these buyer intent keywords like landscape design Keller. There's some searches there. Uh, you want to make sure that you're up and available to be shown in those top positions so somebody will click and come to you. So that that's what you need to do is to increase your backlinks uh, in order to do that. So how do you do that? Well, you can look at your competitors. These guys, Southern Services Landscape, they have 320 backlinks coming from 47 different domains, uh, and they're getting 74 organic searches a month. And so, you know, for every, uh, every, hundred or 10 visits you get, one of those will turn into a lead, maybe two. And then, you know, you're going to, if you close pretty well, you're going to get a couple of customers each time you get another 10 to 20 to whatever buyer intent keywords, the more traffic you're getting with buyer intent keywords, the more likely you are to get more customers from it. So they're coming up number one for Denton Landscaping, Landscaping Denton, Texas. Uh, I know that's sort of a, a a blanket term, you might be doing design, you might be doing outdoor kitchens. Again, you can talk about all these different terms in this area and, and still come up in search for them. So you can look at their backlinks and try to copy what they've got. It's good enough for Google. It's going to be good enough for you. So the more that you uh, spend some time uh, creating backlinks, and it, it, the more it's going to help your organic search. The other thing that you can do uh, that I might want to just mention is you have your, your Google Map Pack. But before I get there, this is, you can pay to be in search here. This is Google Guaranteed. It gives you a uh, – that Google will do a background check, guarantee your work. Uh, if anything goes wrong, they'll take care of it. Um, and to get into this spot, you just want to continue to get reviews. You're not probably not going to come up in Denton because you have an Argyle uh, address. But let me just make sure you're coming up in the Map Pack here. Argyle Landscaping, uh, hmm. Landscape Design. So there you are. That's your profile. Argyle, Texas. Let's try that. 
There we are. Okay. So you're coming up here on the map. Um, and how you get here is you, you, you can see they have a lot of reviews. There's just maybe not a lot of competition around you. So you want to continue to get reviews to come up higher. You also want to uh, get citations. So that means putting yourself in Angie's List and Yelp and Better Business Bureau and all those kinds of directories with your name, your address, and your phone number, making sure that it's consistent. And Google will reward you for that. Uh, get more reviews. Post pictures uh, on a regular basis, geotag them, which means you're telling Google where you're doing your work, and just be descriptive in your services and your description of uh, what you do and where you do it. All right, well, I hope you had a great cruise. Thank you so much for your time, Mark, and uh, we'll look forward to talking. Take care.